so obviously there's a couple levers to pull in, in order to help with that. Uh, obviously, an, an expansion of the child care tax credit to make sure that families can afford it. It's, it's um, a huge uh, cost for parents who don't have generous benefits like family medical leave and, or paid family leave, I should say, uh, which is something that we should have in the United States. We are one of, one of few industrialized countries in America that does not have paid family leave. In the most important, critical developmental time for our kids, that's something I will continue to support, an expansion of the tax credit, and then robust funding into Head Start to make sure that every kid in the United States has a place to go as early as possible if parents have to work uh, that they can get the kind of care and support that they need. And that's a question of priorities. Is this what we want to do or not? And to me, it's like, again, you cut taxes for the top 1% and hope that people have better childcare for their kids. It doesn't work that way. This is collective action that, that we have to administer together and it takes us making it a priority. So as, as someone with a young family, uh, I understand these issues and I see what a lot of working class people are going through and we'll be supportive. Thank you.